This weekend, we had two awesome world record attempts in the women's axle, starting out in the lightweight class and then the heavyweight open class. First up, we had the lightweight class with Rhiannon Lovelace attempting 95 kilos. Rhiannon weighs under 63 kilos. She got so close with two attempts, and I know with her determination, she'll be back to smash that record soon. So in the heavyweight class, we had Annabelle Chapman taking on the world record, which was actually set a few weeks back by Melissa Peacock, who hit 124 kilos. Let's take a look at how Annabelle did. So first up, Annabelle is going for 126 kilos to break the record. She uses a belt clean and there's been a lot of controversy about this. You can see how easily she presses it once it's up to the shoulders. Then she moves on to 131 kilos, which is absolutely massive. I know plenty of heavyweight strongmen that struggle to, to do 130 plus kilos on an axle. The clean is the hardest part. And we're, we're seeing so much controversy online at the moment about belt cleans. Now, Annabelle uses a belt clean, great press. She actually goes on to, tr to attempt 136 kilos to annihilate the record and gets pretty close. Unfortunately, doesn't get it on this occasion. But bringing back to the, to the belt clean, the women, the lighter weight men, they've been doing belt cleans since the start of, 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 of the axle being used in Strongman. It's only the heavyweight men that aren't allowed to use a belt clean. And to be honest... I have no issues with, with even the heavyweight men using the belt to help them with the clean. Obviously, most of the heavyweight guys, we've got a bit more of a, a belly than the, the slimmer under 105s or the under 90 kilo guys. And same with the women, you know, it's, it's harder to, to kind of get that pressure through the midsection for them to clean. Now, for me personally, I don't care how they get it. It's a, a strong man. Get it from the floor to overhead and press it overhead. We have no problem with people doing a split jerk for the overhead. I don't have a problem with the belt clean. If you compare Annabelle's record to Melissa's record, both of them do a belt clean. I've been looking through plenty of records from the under 105 men's, the under 90s, the under 80s. 99% of the athletes are belt cleaning in the lighter weight classes. So why are we getting upset about it? These guys are putting in tremendous effort, the, the effort just to get that axle up to the shoulders and then press it overhead. Absolutely tremendous. Congratulations to Annabelle, she set a new world record. We have some absolutely incredible women competing in the UK right now, particularly in the heavyweight class where you've got the likes of Annabelle, you know, Donna Moore, the three-time world champion, or Andrea Thompson, Lucy Underdown, who's attempting a 300 kilo deadlift in a couple of, actually this weekend coming, she's going for the 300 kilos to break the world record. I wanna see these girls competing against the best around the world, see them all in the same show, that's what I'm excited for now. We need to try and hopefully get the, the travel situation sorted and give these, these ladies the opportunity to compete on a big stage and really see what they can do head to head. While you're here guys, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my awesome strength content.